Hello and welcome to section 6, User Interaction. In the previous section, high charts can read different data formats and fetch data from different sources. In this section, we will learn how to handle input from the user, specifically how to handle different events that are fired within a chart. We'll learn about zoomable charts, master detail charts, chart annotation, and dynamic tooltips. Now we move on to the first video of this section that teaches us how a chart can become zoomable. When working with a large collection of data, we need means to get a portion of data in focus. One way of doing this is zooming in and out on the data drawn out by high charts. In this video, we are going to take a look at how easily x-direction zooming can be turned on in the chart options. Later, we try zooming in the y-direction, and finally, we try both X and Y directional zooming. First, we need to set up a basic high charts page. Let's open highcharts-zoom.html. For this example, we are using a column chart. We also have a large set of data, so we can make use of the zooming feature in the next step. Adding the zooming feature is as simple as adding this one line to the chart property. Add zoom type x on line 17. Now save your file and open it in your browser. You see a lot of data along the x axis. Now try selecting some part with your mouse horizontally. While selecting, you see the selected area with different background color. You can also further zoom in. And then hit Reset Zoom if you want to go back to the original position. Now let's go back to the code editor. Let's change the zoom type from the X to the Y direction. Save the file and open it in the browser. Refresh the page. And try selecting the upper part of the chart vertically. This is how the Y direction looks like. And finally, let's go back to see what happens if you change the zoom type to XY. Let's switch back to the browser. Reload the page with our new settings. Try selecting any part diagonally. Notice, if you try zooming in as much as you can, High Charts make sure you cannot overzoom the chart. It will show some data parts anyway. This is why we like working with High Charts. In this video, we have learned how a chart can be zoomable to all directions, with the help of adding a single line of code to the chart settings. In the next video, we will look at how a details and overall panel can be shown in the same graph.